engine trans going in. It's amazing. How about that? No. Yeah, there you go. It's the wrong way, no? The open A lot of people are swearing by it. The most dangerous thing on working on the car is the, the one we do like every two months. The springs? The springs. <laughs> every two months. The springs. Yeah. Like uh, shrinking the spring to. Yeah. Compressing it? Yeah, compressing it. Man, I need a picture. Yeah. Vito, you should look too. Huh? What? You should look. Look what? And the camera. What happened? You don't trust yourself, Queen? <laughs> Come on, you're a videographer. You can't or a photographer too. You can't do that. Man, it's so nice to have a legend down. Yeah, it's so much easier. Did that come with it? No, it's it's uh it's, it's, it's uh, rings, like but uh the hoist is uh Rosa Sanchez. Should we buy it? Let's I think we're clear. See, bit. watch. We're clear the oil pan almost oh, right almost here. Almost. Yeah. So, so let's let's push it. Push in. it forward a little. I'm watching over here for any wires, making okay. sure that nothing <coughs> free. Push forward. No, okay, very good. Nice. All right. We're clear. We're clear. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Okay. okay. Now we can lower. Now, it. when we lower it, I'm gonna start lowering this. Then straight. I'm gonna have to push this. The opposite. Not yet. We need to lower the engine. Lower the engine first. Copy. Okay. Let's lower that just slightly. Okay. Yeah. I'm liking what I'm seeing. Oh yeah. Hold on, let me check. Picks up. Check that out. So. We can straighten it up now, I think, a little bit. Yeah. Okay. Well, that one.
Yeah. In 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 Tijuana. Oh, guys, engine is in finally. Uh, yeah, now I'm starting to mess with this spaghetti and putting everything back together, and uh, I still have to take out the drive shaft completely and uh, rebuild it. Transmission is not connected yet, but both engine uh, mounts, the bolts are started on those. So yeah, that's good news, guys. Slowly but surely bringing this machine back to life. And we pushed it back into the garage a little more. So yeah, now we can work on it more and easier. Also gonna install this protective cover on the transmission uh, where you access the token barrier bolts. It's really important. That way it doesn't uh, have any problems, any rocks falling in there, jamming anything or damaging something. It's really important, this cover. Make sure you have it. It's pretty crazy, so these wires are all in great shape, obviously, but um, the insulation is just crimpling. It's pretty hard, but everything else is awesome. That's good. Yeah, start connecting the power string, the, tam the tandem pump. Yeah, I can't wait to see this car back on the road, guys. It's been, it's been forever, honestly. This car sat since like 2015. Yeah. It hasn't really moved much, you know, so it needs a lot of love, but we gave it a lot of love, so let's see how she does. Also restored this transmission. Cross member was really rusty. Now it's looking really nice. Beautiful rainy day in Pacific Northwest. And today we're gonna bring this wagon back on the road. I'm gonna finish the rest of the work that needs to be done. And yep. It's gonna be exciting. Okay, finally found this uh, temp sensor. The one that's one pin. Is this one is actually broken, the factory one. It's been broken like that. It has a, uh, so the connector, take the connector off, but look at the, the pin. Like it's, it's no good. So I'm gonna swap it out and have this new one right here. So it's exciting. I knew I had the sensor. So let's put it on. Okay, I got one brand new hose. The other one I had to reuse, unfortunately, because they sent me the wrong one. So it's okay. I just cleaned it up a little bit. It's still in pretty good condition. So, but this one is brand new. Good to go. And that sensor is replaced. Okay, guys, I'm under the car right now. Uh, everything's wrapped up. Um, shifter linkage, all of that stuff, all the connectors speed out with a cable so the only thing is this connector right here for the neutral safety switch i'm really sad about i didn't notice at first but previous owner uh, previous owner broke it taking it off so you can't really lock it so i was able to push it in and everything but i'm just gonna add as of right now just a little bit of like sealant right here so but it's it's still it's holding it in there pretty good but just as an extra precaution, just a little bit of sealant right there. But yeah, everything else is looking pretty good. This pan, unfortunately, I was not able to straighten all the way, but it's gonna be fine as long as it's not leaking. Right now, I'm gonna touch it up actually a little bit here with paint. Um, and uh, yeah, I'm about to show you the flex disc and everything else on that side. Also started installing the, you know, all these, uh, Holding lines, uh, starters all connected to everything, all the lines, and uh, started doing a little bit of fluid film action right there. Also, like on this side, um, the sad part I didn't even know, but the sad part is that, um, like this line right here, it's actually bent right there from you know, previous owner taking out the engine and trans together. Yeah, it's not leaking so. Um, you know, I'm just gonna roll it as is right now. You know, there's just a, a few of those things. And then one more thing is I have, still have to install the exhaust all the way. Okay, right there, as you can see, it's a new flex disc, brand new one, everything connected. Looking good, trans mount is brand new as well. And also put a new shifter bushing right there. It was missing, so it's got a new shifter bushing too.